after work evening of fishing. We go out pretty much every single day. Which means that we had about a month without really doing much of anything, which was called June, because all it did was rain every day. So we're getting out as much as we possibly can at this point. So anyway, I'm just going to do a little bit of largemouth fishing, and hopefully tonight it's good. It's pretty much perfect, actually, right now. High 60s, very little humidity. Uh, it's really pretty out here right now, one of our small little ponds. This is actually the pond that I caught that brown trout in. As you can see, it's really small. It's only 40 acres, so it's not much of a pond. But there are some pretty nice fish in here, and apparently one really pissy brown trout. So without further ado, see whether or not I can catch anything in here. using a wacky worm at the moment. Well, I'm fishing a worm wacky style. It's one of the Cabela's tournament versions. They seem to work pretty well. I would say I've caught about as many fish on these since I got them as I have traditional Senko. I think the action of the Senko on the fall is a little bit nicer. But these are not bad. They're a lot less money than the Senko brand. To my knowledge, no fish have looked at these and then went the other way. Uh, maybe I'm wrong, because I can't see the fish. But I'm assuming that they haven't. Um, smallmouth also seem to like these quite a bit as well. I've been using the... Uh, the weighted head it just gets them down a little bit quicker I know that uh, uh, lots of times just letting them fall under their own weight can produce uh, a nicer action and I would say that that is absolutely true of the Senko brand um, but these for some reason I don't know I just feel that they do a little bit better with that extra jig head weight felt you come over and nip that. Oh, it's a dirty little pickerel. Oh, man. Oh, you guys are a pain in the butt. Yep. Boy, you sure are, huh? There's one. Oh, he nice. wanted that spinnerbait real bad. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Right at the edge of the boat. Ooh, that's yeah. a nice one. Yep. That's a nice fish. Oh. He's not happy and doesn't want to come up, but yeah. No, he does not. There's a nice old fish. Yeah. 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 I'd say about a pound and a half or so. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure the next meal you go for isn't going to be uh, booby trapped. I think you'll probably be fine. <laughs> I 
This is a spinner bait that I caught that brown trout on, actually. Mm -hmm. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Second cast, third cast. Two fish, three casts. That's a nice fish, too. Sure is. <laughs> yes, indeed. A little grumpy. A little grumpy. Here. Come here, buddy. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh, that one's bigger than the last one, too. Wow, you weren't hooked by a whole lot, though, were you? Nope. Yeah. Uh, close to two pounds. I could weigh you, but you're not that big. There he is. There's, there's number three. I've never seen catch so many of them right here. It's the time of year. Mm -hmm. You gotta wait for these weeds to start coming up. And they'll kinda they come out and kinda hang out right there because it's a transition depth wise. Ooh. Wow, you are also barely hooked. A lot of attitude. Not much in the butt department. <laughs> it's true. Uh, yep. it is. <clears throat> Something jumped in there. Mm, nope. Nice and weedy back there. Yeah. I don't really feel like throwing a frog back there and like I said before you can catch them in the thick stuff absolutely but boy it's much harder to get them out of the thick stuff and back to the boat yeah, yeah I felt you pick that up real gentle Might be a decent fish. Close it. Not happy either. No. It's a nice fish though. Yeah. It's a very nice fish. Yeah. It's really dark. So some say you catch over here are very dark. Yeah. There we go. Just gently hooked. Thank you very much. Lots of times when they're darker like that, it's because they've been hanging out in the weeds. Ah, uh, so it's like the lighter they are, that's their version of a tan. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> One back. One. Oh, if I don't dawdle too much on this side over here. Should be a nice one sitting right there, though. Yep, yeah, there he is. I knew there'd be one sitting right there. Yeah. Well, when you see a difference in the bank. Mm -hmm. Plus, I know this pond so well, but that imperfection in the bank where there's a break in the lily pads, you know, the weeds, mm -hmm. there's always one sitting there. <laughs> like, no! Yeah, he doesn't want to come in. He's a nice fish, too, though. Mm hmm. Come here. He's a couple of pounds. He's a very upset couple of pounds. <laughs> yes, he is. This right here is real fish fury. Uh -huh. Yeah, he's not happy. Mm -hmm. no, uh, 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 I'm just, would you come here? Jeez. All right. Yeah. It's about like all the rest of them as far as size. You could eat a little bit better, though. Just saying. But thank it's like you, I was trying. You kind of fudged that up. Mm-hmm. A little bit. Have a good night. Okay. All righty. Text 
Texas rig worm. Oh, it's a pickerel. No, really? Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> all right, I'm going to try to do this without getting all gooped up here, my friend. He's like, yep, I got my teeth ready. Mm -hmm. Yep. Come on. Perfect. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Not together, together, but. Oh, there's one. And it is a pick roll. <sighs> Dang it. Oh. Come here, screwball. I no, know. What's too small for the lure? The fish. Well, you can tell him that. Well, I don't okay. Think no, I don't think he would either. All right. That's enough. You're done. Okay. Goodbye. Sorry, you made me do it. I had to, I had to manhandle you. Mm -hmm. I try not to, you know, but uh, uh, just can't take too much more of that stuff. Every time I tune this stupid thing, it just goes out of tune immediately. I'll get a couple of casts with it where it's good and then it's not good. But yeah, fish for all these years <clears throat> without a fish finder. Isn't that crazy? No, it's not. You don't think so, huh? No, lots of people do it. Oh, he picked that up. Oh, that's a nice fish. Oh, wow. Yeah. All I did was lift it off the bottom. Is he coming right at the boat? Yeah, he is. Yep. Yep. Not very happy. Nope. He's like, can I at least have the worm? Oh, yes, you can have the worm. We'll give it to you at the end. Would you stop that? Oh, <sighs> goodness. The only bad thing about these boats mm -hmm. is that trying to get over the side yeah. is kind of tricky because Unless you have like four, four and a half, five foot arms, it's pretty tough to be able to reach down and you can't really get down low enough, you know what I mean? Uh, 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 you just wait just a second. I'll have that out of your mouth in a jiff. There we go. Thank you, sir. He's a very nice fish. He's a very nice fish. Thank you. Yeah, he flipped me the fin on the way out. Yep. Wow, oh, this is the first time in a long time that I've actually seen, it's almost like the fish have slowed down in a pond as it got to, oh, there is one. As it started to get a little later, usually they're picking up a little bit for that dinner rush. Is that another pickerel? Sure looks like a pickerel. Yeah, it's a pickerel. No. <laughs> Wanna try to do this again, maybe? No, you're too much of a spaz. Come here. Right. Whirling dervish of dumb. Okay, thank you. Goodbye. Wow, at least he threw himself back in the drink. What's funny? <laughs> just laughing because they're just they're like oh, They are, they're absolute nitwits. Ooh, that was a fishy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he went for a dragonfly. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he's big or not, but, you know, I will definitely do the little kid thing, which is throw directly on top of this. <laughs> I got him. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. I that little kid thing just <sighs> I sure did, actually. 
It doesn't feel too bad. No, he's not yeah, bad. Nope. He's like, <laughs> no. <laughs> Come on. All right, yeah. 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 in a jiff. There you go. Thank you very much. Mm-hmm. Nice. Mm-hmm. Not a monster, but fun. Usually I don't, unless I'm fly fishing, I usually don't throw right where they pop like that on the surface because I don't usually get them. I mean, it can happen, but it's not Guaranteed, that's for sure. Wish we had more time to go to different places, but so much of our fishing is done. Oh, there he is, right after work. We have to lots of times go to the same places. Not that the fishing is bad where we go, because it's actually very good. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, I know. Yep. Yep. Ooh. Yep. I know. Come here. Sometimes these little guys are like absolutely just the craziest of all of them. And you are a little guy. But thank you. smallest fish do the most damage to my stuff. There's another one. Apparently there's a couple of them over there. This mm -hmm. guy's not very big. No, but apparently they're hungry. Well, it's almost cast after cast over here. Come here. I see what you were gonna do. <laughs> no. Uh-uh. Let me get that out of your jaw. There. Okay. Well, no picture for you. <laughs> Man, this Kevin Van Dam spinnerbait is... Whew, tough shape. kind of do after a while, you know, it's like, go to Alaska and get off the plane and walk outside, and it's like, whoo, yeah. it's actually a little on the cold side here, mm -hmm. oh, yes sir, right, wow, right there, oh, that might be a nice fish, it sure feels like he's pretty good, wow, he's not happy, yeah, he is. yeah. He's not happy. no, some fish in some ponds, I swear, fight harder than in others. And this pond, to me, has always been that they fight harder than in a lot of ponds. A lot of other places I fish. But thank you. Wow. A little belligerent, perhaps. Pretty much. Like I always say, I can't blame them. Thought I might get one off that rock too, but that was also. An... Oh no, I did get one off the rock. Oh, nice. Yeah, sure did. Decent fish. Not a monster, but. He's not very happy, but... No. Oh, boy.
There you go. Just a little guy. Mm -hmm. Blip. Dang, I was hoping to end it with one more fish right here. Maybe that's just not in the cards tonight, dear. Oh, maybe it is. There he is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he might be all right, actually. He is absolutely bladed right sideways to the boat. And he does not want me trying to turn him. Nope. Absolutely not. Boy. You're not very big, but you are one supercharged little turd, aren't you? I mean, really, truly. Yeah. You are not very big, but wow. What, like he was three times that size? I am impressed, sir. Mm. Boy, he did, too. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Sometimes it just matters how they're hooked and how their head is, you know, what direction their head is turned and whatnot as far as how much pressure they can put against your line, your rod. Oh, well. <clears throat> it's a really good night fishing. We're going to head home now. Have a little coffee, a little tea maybe. Relax. Take a shower and go to work. Do it all over again tomorrow. So, Hopefully you enjoyed small pond fishing here in Maine, spinner baits, um, and uh, senkos, fish wacky style. Really the only baits I use tonight. Try to top water, nothing. But that's pretty common for in here unless you're using big fly poppers. Those work great. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully. Some of you folks might actually subscribe. Ooh, I know, scary. Anyway, thanks. Take care.